What's going on guys? It's your boy Andy Arch and today we are going to talk about one of the best one of the best desk and chair for digital artists and basically for you to work on for you to you know one of the the best desks to prevent to prevent like neck pain back pain because uh as an artist that's that's one of the most common problems is people get you know uh, pro health problems in their spine, neck area, back area, shoulder area. Those are the most common health problems with your artists, right? So here, I just want to show you some of my equipment that can help you guys, you know, prevent those health issues as an artist. So first of all, the first thing I want to show you guys is, okay, so here's my desk. This here is my stand-up desk, right? Uh, so, so you can see here it's got a couple of numbers. This is to, to program the, the table, the desk, as to how high or low you want it. So I'm going to press button number three all the way up for the highest. And as you can see, if you guys can hear it, it's going up, 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 up. Absolutely beautiful, magnificent. Look at that. All right, look how high it is from the ground. Look at the look at the ground. Look how high it is. So here you can stand up, and instead of like bending your neck over the chair, you can stand up and keep working, right? And then I'm gonna press number button number one, and it goes all the way down, all the way down. And then you can set up your digital tablet. Right now, this is a uh, Samsung Book Three. This is great for drawing. It's great. You can take it everywhere. Absolutely magnificent. Right, right. So, um, right. So that's the stand-up desk. This costs about four hundred dollars. There's cheaper options. Now, I do not recommend the cranks, like the ones that you have to like spin to for it to go up, because you'll be spinning that thing forever. It's much better to use this, you know, because those hang those those spinning things to to level up the the table. Uh, those things can break, they can snap, and it's just not the best option. So just get an electric one, and you're good to go. And then the second thing I want to talk about was the chair. Now, what you see here is a mesh, right? A mesh type of office chair. And I got this office chair instead of one of those, what do you call it? Like race car race car gaming chairs i have sat down on those gaming chairs before and let me tell you they are not the most com comfortable things i do not understand why so many people have it i think it's just trendy right i think it's just because since that's what youtubers and a lot of gamers use and it's very popular in the anime community with youtubers since that's basically what they see on youtube from their favorite uh influencers or whatever or gamers they just go and buy it, right? One of those gaming chairs. I've sat on multiple of those. I, I, I think I went to Staples and I sat on one that was like $500. And I'm thinking to myself, why is this $500? This is kind of uncomfortable. Like it, it's also, it's not like it's soft either. It's like very hard. But this, you get this in office chair like this. Mesh. See mesh? Very comfortable. It curves, right? It has a curve here for your back. A, uh, a neck rest and it's just so much more you, you get more movement right it, it allows you to move even more than one of those gaming chairs so this is my recommendation I recommend a mesh uh, office chair and a stand-up desk right I'm gonna put the link in the description so that you guys can go and check it out so um, that's gonna be it for this video I hope this was helpful and uh, probably gonna like review some of my other equipment, such as my uh, audio interface, maybe some of these uh, mic holders, phone holders here. Got a lot of stuff. This is my working. This is my uh, jobs computer. All right, so that's gonna be it for this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Make sure you uh, hit the notification bell, like the video, comment below, tell me what you think, and I will see you guys in the next video. This is Andy Arts.